The first digital camera was created in December 1975 An engineer named Steven Sasson snapped a photo with the world's first fully digital camera at a Kodak lab. It took 23 seconds to record a 100 by 100 pixel image to cassette tape, pictures that could then be viewed on a special display device hooked to a TV set. The first true digital handheld camera was the Fuji DS1P, developed in 1988 but never sold. It recorded images as computerized files. The first digital camera to actually go on sale was the 1990 Dicam Model 1. A gray version was marketed as the Logitech Photoman. It used a CCD image sensor, stored pictures digitally, and connected directly to a PC for download. The digital camera evolves with the Canon EOS Digital Rebel D300, 2003, with a resolution of 3072 by 2048 pixels, 6.29 MP. and the Olympus EI that was created in 2003 with a resolution of 2560 by 1920 pixels, 4.91 MP. When you hear the name Epson, you probably think of printers, but if you've been around cameras long enough, you may remember the Epson RD1 with a resolution of 3008 by 2000 pixels, 6.01 MP, the world's first digital rangefinder. Nowadays, there is a lot of different kind of digital cameras in the market for example, the rugged compact camera. Rugged compact cameras typically include protection against submersion, hot and cold conditions, shock and pressure. Terms used to describe such properties include waterproof, freeze-proof, heat-proof, shock-proof and crush-proof, respectively. The Action Camera, GoPro and other brands offer action cameras which are rugged, small and can be easily attached to a helmet, arm, bicycle, etc. Most have a wide angle and fixed focus and can take still pictures and video, typically with sound. The 360 degree, the 360 degree camera can take picture or video 360 degrees using two lenses back to back and shooting at the same time. And the mirrorless interchangeable lens camera. In late 2008, a new type of camera emerged called a mirrorless interchangeable lens camera. It is technically a DSLR camera that doesn't require a reflex mirror, a key component of the former. While a typical DSLR has a mirror that reflects light from the lens up to the optical viewfinder, in a mirrorless camera, there is no optical viewfinder. The image sensor is exposed to light at all times gives the user a digital preview of the image either on the built-in rear LCD screen or an electronic viewfinder. These are simpler and more compact than DSLRs due to not having a lens reflex system. This was some of the highlights of digital camera history, going all the way back to 1975 with the first digital camera to the latest model.